Hey guys, welcome back to my channel and today I have for you some easy, healthy, back to school breakfast ideas if you're short for time. So let's start with Monday and Tuesday and some mini breakfast burritos for on the go. Now these are best for the start of the week so they don't get soggy. So you will need four eggs whisked, some mini tortilla wraps, some coconut or olive oil, one cup of spinach, one cup of grated cheese, and I'm using one cup of sliced mushrooms, but you can use whatever you fancy. So first off, I'm just melting the coconut oil into a pan. Firstly, I'm adding the sliced mushrooms, but like I said before, you can add whatever ingredients you like. This is just a nice, healthy breakfast option. So I'm gonna wait until the mushrooms are completely cooked, and then I'm adding in the whisked egg, and I'm gonna stir that around until it's nice and scrambled and fully cooked. And then lastly, I'm adding in the grated cheese and the spinach until it's nicely wilted and ready to go. So you're gonna allow your mixture to cool and then we're gonna start making the burritos. So the most important thing about breakfast in the week, if you are short for time, is preparation. Use Sunday if you can as your prep day so you ensure you never miss breakfast and prevent the morning rumbles in class. So once your egg mixture has cooled down, you're next going to take a layer of cling film and then a mini tortilla wrap on top. Adding your filling, you're going to add this to the front of the tortilla wrap and then you're just going to fold in the sides and start wrapping until you have a mini burrito. Now I'm doing two each, so two for Monday and two for Tuesday. And these are really great, these mini burritos, as you can eat them on the go as they're portable. So once you've finished making them, wrap them up in the cling film and then pop on your Monday and Tuesday labels so you know that they're assigned for them days so you don't miss breakfast in the morning. And then you can just sellotape them onto the cling film so you're really organised and good to go for the start of the week. Okay, so that's Monday and Tuesday sorted, so let's move on to Wednesday and Thursday and some yummy pre-made smoothie packs. So you will need a selection of your favourite fruit all chopped up. I'm using some mango, banana, grapes and some berries and also some spinach. So you're going to need some of these Ziploc bags and you're going to start adding your ingredients in. Now I don't know about you, but I love a good smoothie and these are perfect for a quick, healthy breakfast as you can put in whatever you want. Here I'm doing a loaded berry smoothie and a mango and banana mix. And I also love adding spinach as it's easy to blend and contributes to your daily veg intake. Once you've finished filling your smoothie packs, then you're good to go with zipping them up and popping them in the freezer until you need them. One tip I would say is don't overfill the bag because obviously you want the right amount for each cup of smoothie that you make for that day. So next I'm popping on my Wednesday and Thursday so I know they are pre-made and ready to go when I need them and I just popped a bit of sellotape over them as well. So just pop them in the freezer and then just get them out sort of five or 10 minutes before so they thaw a little bit and then you're ready to go with popping them in your smoothie maker. So 
Now another great way to get some extra good nutrients into your body is to incorporate a supplement into your morning routine. Now I like to take either Corella tablets or add a green powder to my smoothie which is packed full of powerful nutrients and antioxidants. So once you've added all your ingredients, then it's time to add your liquid to help that smoothie blend nicely. Now I'm adding 100% pineapple juice to this mango smoothie, but you can add water or coconut water or whatever you like. So next, blend up your smoothie and then you're good to go with serving it. And this is just such a quick and easy idea for the morning, especially like I said, if you are running late. And you can also pop this in a tumbler and have it on the go while you're walking to school. Lastly, on to Friday and some quick porridge oats. Now this is a great healthy breakfast if you don't have much left in the cupboard by Friday. Now I like to store these porridge oats packs for an emergency quick breakfast as these are great as you just add a drop of milk, mix it together and pop it in the microwave for the recommended time. Then to finish I add some apple and seeds to garnish as this is usually all we have left by the end of the week. If you do find you haven't added enough milk once the porridge is cooked, then take it out of the microwave and pop a little bit more milk and mix it together until you get your right consistency. Then obviously, like I said, add your garnish and that is Friday taken care of and you're done for the rest of the week. So guys, thank you so much for watching and if you did get inspired by this video, don't forget to give it a thumbs up. Also, don't forget to subscribe and follow me on Instagram, Pinterest and Twitter for more inspiration. And if you missed my two previous videos, then go ahead and click on the links on the right to check them out. Have a lovely weekend guys and I'll see you in my next video. Take care, bye.